What's up everybody, it's your boy Kid Smooth from TickGN.com and today I'm reviewing Forza Horizon 3. Yes, Playground Games and Turn 10 collaborative effort once again has turned into gold. Another Forza Horizon game and it's another blast, man. Forza Horizon is the latest Forza release for the Xbox One and the Windows 10 PC. For the first time, Playground has a Forza game on the PC, so this should be interesting. The, the Horizon Festival this time around takes place in Australia and the folks over at Playground could not have picked a better location. The music is okay, it's pretty upbeat, the visuals are breathtaking and the game runs smoother than a V12 engine. Simply put, Forza Horizon 3 is the best you can ask for in a racer. Just when I thought nothing would stop or would top Forza Horizon 2 from being the best racing game, Forza Horizon 3 only trumps it. Now let's start by the graphics. Horizon 3 is easily one of the best looking games in the series. It's pretty, it's bright, it's colorful, and it's freaking amazing. Not as detailed as the Forza Motorsport series, but somehow Playground manages a high level of detail with every vehicle. Forza Horizon 3 is a beauty to look at. It offers HDR support on the Xbox One S if you have a 4K TV, and it can be played in 4K resolution if you own a rig beast enough to run it at such high settings. Other than resolution and the option of 60 frames per second on Windows PC, there's actually virtually no difference between the console version and the PC version. They almost look identical when you discount the resolution. I've tested both and I was still in awe with both results. Of course, I prefer the 60 frames per second on the PC, but at 30 frames per second on Xbox One, the game is no slouch. The weather plays an important role and you really get to see the diversity in the graphics of Forza Horizon 3. From sunup to sundown to random puddles in the ground, Forza Horizon 3 ability to bring everything to life is so impressive. The only drawback to Forza Horizon 3 is that some of the environments in the game isn't as illuminated as others, so when it gets dark, you literally can't see. Please check out my stream on the Inner Circles uh, YouTube channel and you'll see where I there was portions I could not see where I was. It was just too dark and I had to use my head lights and I had to use uh, pretty much the driver view to try to get a better sense and so but it's not like that at night every time it really all depends where you're at in the game which I guess is realistic now let's talk about gameplay we all know Forza is known for superb gameplay I'm not the best at racers. In fact, I'm probably below average. You don't need to be an expert on racing games to enjoy Forza Horizon 3. It's fun. You will have a good time playing whether you're smoking your friends to claim first place or you're straggling behind Dravatars trying to tie for last place. The game runs smooth and there's so much to do in the game. There's no virtual end in sight. Forza is back with even more customizations. Try applying a clown's horn to a perfect Bentley or out dueling a Beamer in a Warhog. Forza Horizon's greatest attribute is its gameplay and other racing IP should start to take notice. Now, as far as the campaign goes, it's not too much different for Forza Horizon 2. At the end of the day, you get more control. Forza Horizon 3 campaign is very expansive but customly made for the user. Pick a character, give them a name. Your name is likely in a game like my name, my real name, Jerry, is in a game so of course that's the name I use. Perform tricks, game fans, host racing events, hire and fire friends. To race with you there is so many objectives with just as many cool distractions and you don't have to experience it all by yourself have a friend join you that's right forza horizon 3 offers up to four players online co-op everything can be done with a friend that is freaking awesome multiplayer forza horizon 3 supports up to 12 players online it also supports cross play between xbox and windows pc Forza Horizon 3 open world isn't limited by its multiplayer feature either. It only enhances the game and it turns the open world experience into a shared world experience. You can challenge others in many different modes other than just racing. You can also just roam around and earn points. Just cruising like Will Smith in 97. <laughs> now Forza Horizon 2 was best known for a sick soundtrack. Forza Horizon 3 soundtrack takes a backseat to the last game. However, it more than makes up for it by allowing users to connect their Groove Music service to the game. This is a major plus if you are subscribed to Groove Music. Other than the music you cruise to, the vehicles sound as good as they look, you can hear crashes miles away, and you can hear the sound of your tires hydroplaning through puddles of water. Once again, 
Forza Horizon delivers. As far as our verdict, I thought Forza Horizon 2 was the best racer I played in the last 10 years when it released. Two years later, Playground and Turn 10 releases the best racing game to date. Forza Horizon 3 is an instant classic with hours upon hours worth of content. Choose the way you play, play like a pro, play casually, play however you want. Forza Horizon 3 has no limits. There is no wrong way to play. I said it before, I'm not great at racers, but for some reason, my lack of skill has not stopped me from enjoying Forza Horizon 3 as much as I do. Even if you're not a fan of racing games, Forza Horizon 3 has something for you. That's why I have to give this game a 9.4 out of 10 kid smooth certified thank you guys for watching for all your latest gaming news previews and reviews visit tickgn.com and be sure to subscribe to kid smooth and the inner circle youtube channel xbox is the best box and i am the best bot